Bia France, e kele kwa mou no. Ane eme, ane e kwe ku, ane eme eme. La ohon ane e kwe kwa na ati ti ike. Makanam, o ge e zuko. Mbe e ge e jama, nde wonde. So what I'm saying this moment, is that all the saboteurs in Biafra land should understand that it is time to know who is who. Because Oko Diova, we have come to do justice, to pay the righteous and the wicked at the same time. Because ignorance is not an excuse to the law. Whatever that have motivated you, taking away life that does not belong to you, every life is given, given by the Almighty God. So you cannot claim to have created anybody, even if you are the biological parents of that person or those people after God is the government of Biafra all right God created Biafra Biafrans and created uh, the, the land of Biafra so and um, he in heaven have the rule over everyone i'm here to let you know that judgment shall start from the houses of southeast politicians the judgment shall start from the houses of Igbo elites who have made up their mind to be a terror to the good citizens of Biafra nation. And this judgment shall continue until we are sure that there is none of them anymore. The saboteurs shall live Biafra land. And those who are claiming to be on uniform or in a uniform from Nigeria who are illegitimately sojourning in Biafra nation or Biafra land carrying out their illegal activities have been severally warned. And they shouldn't say they didn't hear or they are not aware or they don't know. We have spoken often. Leave our roads. Leave our lands. Leave our territory. And you pay deaf ear because of 50,000 naira a month that your president orders to give to you. And you have decided to take a big a big risk by moving into another man's country to commit genocide and war crime. And I want to say that the end of the road for the wicked have come. As a wicked person or wicked people you have termed yourself to be, then we have taken it in good faith to make sure that every kind of insubordination and wickedness being exercised by person or group of persons in Biafra land shall be terminated without mercy and without looking back because allowing you to continue killing innocent people in Biafra land for ethnic cleansing is an abomination. 
and uh, it will seem as if that Biafrans are relegated and uh, at the same time subjugated, that they cannot go beyond a certain limit. For your information, Biafrans are not limited from doing anything, especially now we are in the air, we are on the land, and we are in the sea. Understand me. Don't say you didn't hear me clear. Because we are going to bench you. We must make sure that incessant killing, impunity killings, pervertment of judgment, lack of sensitivities, you know, mental disorders, and um, all kinds of cannib cannibalism attitude going on in Biafra land from Nigeria shall be tackled in no distant time. But what I'm telling you this moment is that the proper sanitation of Biafra land shall start from the Igbo elites houses. As we are removing the illegitimate uniform people from Biafra land, so it is applicable to anyone, and I mean anyone who have decided that the Biafra nation will not come. That, play, that person will go down six feet. Freedom fighting is not for children, all right? Freedom fighting is for matured men and women, people of integrity, people with sincerity, people on fire, educated people, wealthy people, for your information. And this is why the joint voice or voices of Biafrans can no longer be undirected in the whole world because we all have spoken in one voice and we are acting in the same way. My brother is my brother. Every Biafran is my brother. As simple as that. There is no disparity. There is no tribulation. Uh, no tribalism, no tribalism, hmm? and at the same time, there is no ostracism. And uh, for your information, we don't intend, and we are not thinking of leaving any Biafran in Nigeria. Rather, we shall make sure that we hold your 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 belt, hold your waist, and uh, your trouser and drag you into Biafra land, throw you inside inside Biafra land, whether you like it or not, because you people have proven that where you are occupying, where they are telling you like a dog to go, you refuse to go. You turn around and come and sit down, they will hit you. You shout, Wah! then still, it will not pain you. You turn around again and go. They will hit you like a goat. You do meh, you go back again and sit down. And they have poured many of you hot water. Ibophobia. Are you hearing me? What is trending now and what is happening now in Nigeria is Ibophobia. Provided you are an Igbo man in any part of Nigeria, you are not welcomed. Anybody can give any excuse or reason why it was so. But does not to shoot to my own idea. The major reason is that Igbos are very industrious, very rich in the whole world and every part of Nigeria. And at the same time, you cannot fathom their wisdom. They cannot survive with any little thing. 
way which you cannot 